I'm just looking at myself and I'm like, okay, your face looks cute, but your studio looks better. Oh my God! Welcome to my new and renovated studio. <laughs> Hello, how are you? I hope you're doing great. My name is Karina Berenice. Welcome to my channel. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button, like this video, and turn on the bell notification so you don't miss any of my fabulous videos you haven't even watched the video but i'm sure you're gonna love it i'm gonna go ahead and give you a minute i'll be here i'm gonna wait okay you did that okay awesome <laughs> i was a little unsure on how to name this video i was debating whether to call it a massive thrift haul finds or selling 2021 spring trends outfit ideas because it can literally go either way so for today's video i decided that i'm gonna be doing a little bit of both and i am so excited you guys i have no idea i've been waiting to make this video for the longest time but i didn't want to do it until my studio was renovated and cute i've been literally preparing to do this video since february as you saw on the previous clips i took you thrifting with me it honestly amazes me how i was able to come across so many goodies and i am so excited to show you i'm not going to show you everything i just picked the best and my favorite finds because if i showed you everything trust me this video would go on for like an hour you know what's not going to be long this intro because i hate long intros and i feel like i've already been talking too much and i don't want to do that let's go ahead and get this video started it is obvious that this year is a melting pot it's all about extravaganza exploring different and funkier styles and i think this has to do that we were locked up for so long last year that we want to explore we want to go out we want to be seen we want to be heard and we're gonna be seeing this throughout fashion there's no specific style for this year it's just a lot of things throwing into a pot i am here for the trends i am here for the fashion i have never seen anything like this we're talking outwardly we're talking fashion that is just to the extremes that is very playful colorful retro futuristic future nostalgia maybe because we're hoping of a better future that's what future nostalgia means hope of what the future would be like let's get started 99 of these items i got thrifting but the ones that i didn't i'm gonna be linking the items in my description so you have a hold of them okay so we're gonna start off with accessories and the first items are scarves i suggest that if you're in the thrift store you have to go through the scarves plus scarves are very multi-purpose starting with this beautiful scarf look at the colors hot pink yellow green i love this green hem on the edge that it has this next one is this beautiful baby blue mesh scarf that has this very pretty design right here I showed you this scarf in my thrift with me video go ahead and check that one out zebra is the statement print this year very classy black and white you can pair it with anything I also got this very beautiful silk cheetah print scarf oh my god this one look at the abstract print the colors very 70s when I saw this I was like your mind and you can never go wrong with just one color scarf this one is specific it has this very beautiful design so it's not just a black scarf i am obsessed okay going on to purses look at these oh my god everything sequin rhinestone everything that shines you gotta have it this year girl starting off with these these give me hannah montana i love the color i love the hold of it it's tiny and i love that i have two of them because they're very similar but very different at the same time i also have this beautiful gold hobo purse this like u shape these are the type of purses we're gonna be seeing this year i have another sequined purse it's very different, but again, the glitter, the rhinestones, the sequins, anything that shines like this. Another trend that we're seeing this year is color blocking. And I found these beautiful purses. I already showed you this one in my monochromatic looks. Go ahead and watch that video. The sequin, the glitter, the rhinestones, and the color blocking 
so beautiful and then this one is very similar but the colors are very different these tones are a little darker and this purse is beaded all throughout and this one has to be my favorite I've shown you this one in some of my previous videos and I've said it and I'm gonna repeat it again this purse is the best of three worlds the fur the fringe the print this paisley print is coming back because 60s mod is coming back perfect if you've seen some of my outfit videos you know that i love to wear gloves i just think it elevates the look and it looks very sophisticated for example i have these very pretty white leather ones but the trend that you're gonna be seeing for spring and summer are mesh gloves these are leather these are more for the winter but these oh my god look how beautiful you can tell that they're mesh they're more airy more fresh and these ones you can get a hold of them because i got them from shein it also elevates your look it makes your outfit look funkier and this trend is nylon socks or tights oh my god just look at the packaging so beautiful very 60s mod and you can tell that the packaging is vintage it's like a mustard yellow and it has these little designs right here so beautiful these red tights i love the color very vibrant as well as these hot pink tights and these ones are actually fishnet so cute okay now sunglasses so this year we're looking at bigger sunglasses we're saying goodbye to the tiny little useless ones which don't get me wrong i still love my closet is full of them but this year we're looking at big squared or round sunglasses and i have two pairs and also one very important thing to the sunglasses is the tinted glass we want to see funky colors blue yellow orange green all of that cute stuff that's what we want to see these are so beautiful round very good logo and also the blue tint oh my god cute oh <laughs> okay and these other ones are my favorite look at the yellowish orange tint to them and the best part is that they're coach and they have these really cute rhinestones on the side so cute mood <laughs> another chunky trend of course the iconic chunky clay rings they're so fun so cute they're even fun to make i made these yesterday and they were so easy this is a button and i just put it in there i didn't have to do much honestly just put it in there and mold it into a ring this is like a little frog it's very ugly but i love it it's like an ugly toad and i also made this one it looks like a rosca de reyes this necessarily isn't a trend but i feel like we should start trying it more statement earrings Look at these beautiful ones. <gasps> I bought these in Mexico. They're so cool, so groovy with the eye, the rhinestones, even the shape of it. And I'm so sorry. I bought these off from like a little stand, so I don't have any information. I also bought these really cute flower power mod inspired earrings at Shein. Okay, another trend that I am loving, I am literally obsessed with, are furry, chunky hats. Look how cute oh my god he still has a tag i got this at buffalo outlet for 24 dollars. it was a little expensive but i think it's worth all the 24 dollars because it is so unique and it definitely elevates your outfit i know i'm saying this a lot but exotic things like this that no one usually wears those are the things that you want okay on to the next trend cowboy has oh my god i am mexican so i am already used to these but these are just like funky cute trendy ones that i'm obsessed with i love this pink one i had been looking for one for the longest time and when i found it at goodwill i was like after finding this one, it was no long enough that I found this other one. Oh my god, it's so cute. Just plain white. And another trend that ties to the hats are the cowboy boots. And when I found these... Ah! Oh my god, look at the colors. So perfect, so me. I could not have asked for any cuter boots other than this knowing that the trend this year is wearing boots with funky clothes 
Going back to the all chunky, go-go chunky boots. I was hoping that I would find something like this and I didn't find it exactly like that, but I found something similar and I am so happy with the find. These very cute black go-go boots, I love them because they're more subtle and these are wearable. These, I feel like girls could actually have a hard time wearing, but these, so perfect i love the square toe the heel very subtle oh my god these other ones <gasps> look at the chunky heel the chunky strap the cute flower i also got these beautiful kitten heels i love the rhinestone these are a little bit more elegant <gasps> oh my god look at the print so funky so colorful very 70s they're just kitten heels but i love that you can tie them up your leg it elevates the look okay on to close finally these are just very cute graphic tees with very fun designs on the front and the first one is this beautiful sequined boot one <laughs> very simple again it's just a red tee and i love these because you can layer them you can put a funky mesh shirt under a leather jacket up next is this beautiful orange one it's like a little lion it's embroidered and it has these cute rhinestones and then this one that is also leading to another huge trend which is prints oh my god it has some sequins color block different prints mix and prints zebra cheetah snake um giraffe i believe love it how I mentioned earlier we're talking about animal prints psychedelic abstract twirls swirls flower power geometric prints funky prints mixing prints anything that has to do with prints that's what we're talking about so i'm gonna start off with this beautiful jacket look at the color block the colors the geometric figures then we're going on to this beautiful iconic cheetah furry jacket then going on to psychedelia abstract watercolor is this beautiful mesh shirt i bought this one at shein and the link is in my bio when i found this one at the thrift store i was like are you kidding me? I was not expecting such a great find. Look how beautiful this is. Oh my god. This is a bikini cover-up, but I'm gonna be wearing it as a top. So it has multi-purpose, and I am here for it. Then I have this beautiful flower power. I love the colors, the abstract flowers. <gasps> I found this at Buffalo. Then I have this very groovy, abstract, sequin, weird fabric kind of shirt. I am obsessed. They are the type of shirts that cinch and like they bounce. They're so fun. And then I also found this beautiful metallic kind of silky shirt. It's very 70s. I love the design to it. It's just so perfect. Now we're going on to checkerboard. I don't like the typical white and black checkerboard. I feel like it's just it's not me. But then when I found these, it was just like God telling me, give it a try, girl. Give it a try. This is not your typical checkerboard kind of shirt. This is giving me 80s color block type of inspo. The abstract print, the checkerboard, the color block, the colors. I also found this very cute mini skirt. Again, it's checker, but it's not the typical white and black. It's a very cute tan color. It's also mesh, and I think it's really cute. It's very sexy. And this one is not really checkerboard. It's more like a color block, but I love that it's black and white, and it does the job. Look how beautiful this skirt is. Those two previous skirts were a transition to this new topic, which is mini micro skirts. These go back to the 70s when girls were finally introduced to cute, sexy skirts. I found this really cute micro pink skirt. I actually found this in the bikini section. Then I found this very cute black mini skirt in the sports section. Tennis skirts tend to be a little shorter and that is what we're looking for look at this one oh my god the rhinestone glitter sequence metallic this one is from victoria's secret but i actually got it thrifting and oh my god it was such a beautiful find and because we're talking about bottoms now we're going on to hot pants hot pants are what describes 2021 fashion so let me start with these 
Oh my god, look at the colors. They are just one color. They are high-waisted. Both of them are flared pants. The fit is great. They are so cute. These next ones are so funky, so groovy. The thing with these is that they are skinny. They are not flared, but they are still so cute and I can make them work. These next ones give me early 2K Hawaiian punch vacation. Oh my god, they are so beautiful. Look at the print. And the best part is that they're mid-calf and they have these little cute strings one other trend watch for summer is this very specific like floral print you're gonna be seeing this a lot and last but definitely not least these have to be my favorite metallic oh my god look at these beauties the flare disco the fabric the color these are so beautiful and the best part is that i got them off from Amazon so you can get them as well. No, this is not sponsored. But I had been looking for these type of pants for the longest time. Ah! Love them, love them so much. This next trend is more inspired on the 2K and it is a symmetry. I've been calling it, I don't know why, it's something about it that it's just so funky. I'm in love with this type of style. It is this very cute mesh asymmetrical. This is more of a bikini cover up, but I'm gonna use it as a top and you're gonna love it. So now we're gonna be talking about fur trimmed. I am in love with this trend. I've been wanting one of these jackets, but I have not been able to find one, but it's okay because I was able to find this item and it's so nice because one, it's a vest, two, it's color block, and three, it has the fur trim. I am so in love with this. We're talking Victorian or lingerie corsets, whatever you wanna call them. If you find it in the thrift store, get it, girl. Cause the more vintage they look, the better. I love this trend because you can cinch anything, any sweater, slip on dress, dress shirt, you can cinch it with these corsets and the look is fire. I don't have boobs, so it's very hard for me to find a corset that I can fill. But I found this very cute one that doesn't even have cups. And I was like, you are meant for me. And it's this very pretty black corset. As you can see, it doesn't have any cups. It's perfect for me. It's so cute. I love you. It has this very pretty lace up here and it is a silk material. It is so cute. And finally, you've seen me worn this in almost all of my outfit videos, but it's because it's essential, it's perfect, and you can use it for everything and anything. And it's this very cute white corset from Princess Polly. I suggest you find something similar because it is just so convenient. And now for the fun part, let's go on to the outfit looks.
this was a longer video than usual, let me know in the comments if you like these type of videos or if you want me to separate thrift hauls from outfit ideas, trends, whatever. You name it, girl. Your opinion here is what matters the most. So let me know in the comments if you liked it or not. What should I change? Should I change this? Should I change that? Thank you so much for watching my video. Stay blessed, loved, and healthy. I'm sending you millions of virtual kisses. And I'll see you on my next video. Oh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, like this video, and turn on the bell notification so you don't miss any of my fabulous videos. I'll see you on my next video.